but, but but I kind of I don't really um I'm just doing my work, mate. Yeah. Get everything sorted out. Jay, what's what's the fuck's going on with the knife crime with the kids these days, bruv? Well, boy, tell I tell me. You, I tell you the honest truth. This is really strange because when these two white guys, white girls, a white guy and girl got killed the other day, yeah. everyone was going crazy about the knife crime. Yeah, yeah the three of has got to get involved. Part of our army got, got to get, get involved, and I found it really strange because black guys, black people, have been killing, killing um, each other for ages, yeah. you know, and and no one had done nothing about it and it's still happening yeah. but as soon as these two um, white people got killed yeah. obviously by their own kind they realised now it's nothing to do with a black and white thing it's a culture it's a knife culture yeah. you know yeah. and, and, I think, and I find I find it very um, disturbing that you have to wait for um, two white people to get killed before they have to take this thing serious yeah. now the knife crime to me is all about a lot of it's got to do with appearance as well, because the parents must know what the children are getting up, getting up to. You got parents, you got parents who turn a blind eye to right. stuff because the, because the son may be on the street um, selling drugs or whatever, and bringing money into the household, and they and they, they accept it, and uh, people don't want to don't want to admit it, but it's yeah. the truth. Yeah. You know, people they, they, they do stuff and they support the family. So when when, when this boy is leaving the house with. Um, bulge anymore whatever yeah, yeah. you know the, the parents are letting it go because this guy is because the breadwinner because the dad the, the dad is not um uh, putting put, put in, put in 100% into the kid's life so mm. he becomes the breadwinner mm. but the only how going to get you know, the only how going to get tackled we need more mm. ethnic mm. mentorings mm. Men, mentors around because a lot of uh, uh, to be the truth and the truth black kids are killing black kids mm. it's, 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 not, it's not you have to make it up mm. black kids are killing black kids you know, okay, the, the uh, white white guys white guys do do it, mm. but majority to me, mm. especially in London, mm. is the black kids. Mm. So the black kids need to get tackled before mm. before this gets it's worse. It's out, of, it's out of hand already. But what we need, we need a more of I don't want to say policing, but we need these mentoring, these mentors to come mm. up with a solution. Um, for the youths on the street, and at the moment, the mentorings, a lot, a lot of mentor, mentors mm. do a lot of um, voluntary work, mm. you know. And and um, people need to get paid. Mm. You can't be keeping doing voluntary work without getting paid. Mm. Mm. You Doesn't know, people, like that, you know, that work, people no. need to get paid, and, and a lot of people no. mentoring is coming out of mentoring yeah, because the government is not, is not supporting the mentors. Oh, you mean? You yeah. know, so so mm. so so that's why it's falling at the wayside because. Um, people need people need to get paid, yeah, and they put a lot of work in, a lot of hours as well, 100%. loads of hours. Oh yeah, you know what I mean. But yeah, I, I think the knife crime, only, only solution to knife crime can be done is that parents need parents need to get more involved. Yeah. And we've been saying this for ages, but parents are not going to get involved. A lot of parents are frightened of their kids, mm, mm. terrified I mean, their kids. I mean, when you were growing up and that, you you was frightened of your mum, innit? No, too rotten. Oh? Yeah, most definitely. Yeah. You fight, you fight, you fight, it's the other way around now, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's the other way around. Yeah. You know what I mean? If the mums, mums are fighting mums the kids. Fighting, yeah, because the the, mm. the, 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 the uncles and aunt, mm. the uncles and aunts aren't getting involved no more mm. because, mm. because it caused a rift between the family where the family unit back in the days, maybe in, say in, in the 50s, 60s, where if my, if my auntie see me on the street walking around with four or five boys, she's going crazy. Mm. My uncle's going to go crazy and send me home. Mm. You, 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 mm. the, the, the uncle, the uncle, the uncle and the aunties are, 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 are acting mm. like they're um, friends, friends with their nephews. Mm. Mm. It's not good, mm. Mm. you know. You, and and you, and you got kids, you got kids calling their mum and dad by, the, by their first name. Ridiculous. Mm. Mm. They, they, there's no, but the boundaries are gone. That's why the kids, are, the kids are just taking a, taking a piss, and they're, and they're rubbish on the streets. Mm. But it, it, we need, we need, a, we need a bigger change. We need more change. We need no more. We need parents to get more involved, mm. you know, in the, in their kids, in their kids' life. You know, and and come on, kids come in their house. Mm. They go upstairs in the room. They don't. You don't see them again. Mm. Again, what are they doing in the rooms on Instagram, mm. or, or, on social media, yeah. posting stuff? Oh yeah. Um, the mums and mums, mums, not mums, mums are fighting to go into the kids' room. Kids mm. telling, killing mums, mums and dads get out of the room. Oh, Ridiculous. Man. Sad, huh? Mm. Sad, but you know, that's what.